back with another Crafty Sasha video, and today I am going to show you how to build this sports car. So you can see out the front, we got the windshield, and the little emblem on the front, and the headlights. On the side, we got the white stripe, and on the back, we got the red lights, and then the big wing on the top. So these are all the pieces you'll need for it. You can pause the video here if you want to see these better and let's get started so first you're gonna want to start with your black concrete and you're gonna want to place one go one two three blocks place another one and then go one block over place another one three blocks place another one so that way you have your four tires right here and then the next thing you're gonna want to do is take your polished black stone stairs, place three of them across wherever the front oh, you want your car to be, and along the back, place three facing the opposite way, so facing downward while these are facing upwards. You might have to place some temporary blocks for the back one. And then if we get the slabs here, the polished black stone slabs, you place one here, and then three across the top, just like that, at our front wheels. So this is where the stairs are placed up, right? And then over here, then we are going to get in three item frames and place them across the front bit here. And then put iron ingots on the two sides, and then rotate them. So this one was two clicks, and this one was three clicks to get them in the orientation we want. And then for the one, for the spot in the center, we want to take a sandstone stair and turn it so that way the pointed bit is facing down like that. So that would be one, two, three turns to get it looking like this. And then the next thing we're going to do just get our polished black stone slabs back out and place one, two, three blocks, one, two, three blocks, three blocks. That way we end up with the little three by three square in the middle here, nine blocks. And then we're going to fill in this little spot between the wheels where the back is. So they should be connected now. So the next thing we're going to do is place slabs on the top of both of the back wheels here and then we are going to get our glass here so we're going to get our glass blocks and place one two three right across the center just like this and then our glass pans on both sides just like that so that way it looks like the windshield has ears or something I don't know and then the next thing we're going to do is we're going to place stairs beside this piece of glass so that way the glass connects to the back side of the stair and then the little piece that's cut out is facing towards the bottom then we're going to place two slabs on either side of the glass just like that so that way we should have something that looks a little bit like a car shape now now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to make this back back here so we're going to place two stairs facing up with the polished blackstone and then one polished black stone slab. And then we're gonna place three slabs across the top. So that way we get our little spoiler on the back of the car. And then up on the top here, on top of these two pieces of glass in the center, we're gonna place slabs, but we're gonna leave this front one open. So the next thing we need to do is put all the signs and all the little fun details on it. So, on this piece of glass here in the back, we're going to place a hanging sign and not put anything on it. So that way it looks like it's a little connecting piece of the sports car. And then right here on the front bit, on the front bumper of the sports car, we're going to place a sign on the side. And then we're going to skip the block where the wheel is, place three more on these slabs. And then we're going to place one up at the top here on this slab right here. 
it's one block up above the tire here and then we're gonna place one on oop, not on the front do the same thing on this side one on the side of the front bumper and then one two three along this side here and then the one up on the top here and then on the back here we're gonna place one two three and then right on top of it one two oop, two three so that we have six right beside each other in the back we're not gonna put any up on the top there and then we're gonna have three here one up there and then one here at the front so that is all the signs on and then you can see here what I did is there are one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven symbols there and I spaced them the whole way over and then I put the white dye and the glow ink sack on them and then this these two are completely full these ones I did all the way up I did 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 at the bottom. And then I put the top 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 symbols. And then two of the symbols overlap in the towards the center there. And then up at the top here, I did 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 symbols. So that way it sort of has that line that goes up. And then I did exactly the same on this side of the car, except for I reversed and used the other, the other variation of the symbol, so that way they're both facing forward. And then on the back here, I just put this text here on the, on the back for the logo. And then I went from the very bottom for these two on either side, and just did equal signs the whole way across. And then at the bottom here, equal signs the whole way across at the very top of the sign. So that way we end up with the red. And then we can put the red dye on and the glow ink sacks on all the windows. Oh, not the windows, the signs. And then we will get a car that looks like this. This is another Crafty Sausage video. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe too while you're at it.